The days of a do-anything luxury sport wagon may be numbered, but they aren't over yet. Mercedes-Benz proves that by pulling back the cloth on the sixth-generation E-Class wagon. As with its smaller sedan sibling, Mercedes breathes new life into the 2024 E-Class wagon, with a redesign and a host of new tech. The new generation brings new styling as well as some physical growth for the E-Class estate, which is 0.9 inch longer than its predecessor. The extra length is said to provide more legroom for rear seat passengers. An additional 1.1 inches of width means extra space to stretch your arms too. Improving the practicality of the form factor, cargo room increases from 22 cubic feet with the rear seats up to an SUV rivaling 65 cubes of storage with the seats folded. Style-wise, the E-Wagon earns a new front grille and the taillights now feature two star-shaped elements, akin to the Mercedes Star logo. The 2024 E-Class Wagon is as extravagant inside as the sedan counterpart. The long roof version comes standard with two displays, but the high-tech, three-display superscreen is available here as well. Just like with the standard E-Class, the rest of the cabin features rich-looking leather and metal switchgear. Ambient lighting wraps the dashboard and ties together the rest of the interior. The optional active ambient lighting package allows the lights to change with the beat of the music. The light strip can also display visual alerts from the driver assistance systems to warn the driver of potential dangers. When equipped with the optional front passenger screen, the super screen extends the passenger can stream videos and games, even while the car is in motion. According to Mercedes, the system is safe due to a technology that blocks the driver from seeing dynamic content on the screen. Mercedes also installed a handful of third-party apps on the central display, including TikTok, Zoom, and even Angry Birds, while the built-in entertainment system allows for streaming as part of a subscription plan. Zoom uses the optional selfie and video camera that comes with the super screen and requires the vehicle to be stationary to function. Instead, we're more likely to see the updated 375 horsepower turbocharged 3.0-liter inline-6 hybrid that powers the new E450 sedan. The hybrid systems are said to reduce turbo lag and smooth the operation of the auto start slash stop system. It's likely the wagon will also follow the sedan with standard all-wheel drive and a 9-speed automatic transmission. There are still a lot of unanswered questions for the new E-Class wagon. Pricing has yet to be announced, and we're still waiting on official confirmation the new generation is even coming to America. Sales are set to start in the fall for Europe, with more information likely to released before then.